We're talking about figure skating today. The Canadians just pulled off a gold medal in the team event and they were full value for it. They really committed themselves to it. There were seven of the 17 Team Canada figure skaters were in on the team event. Patrick Chan went the full distance in the men's event. Caitlin Osmond and Gabrielle Daleman split the women's. The pairs team of Megan Duhamel and Eric Radford went the distance. So too the ice dance team of Tessa Virtue and Scott Moore. And that strategy really paid off. They got committed to this thing way more than they were in Sochi four years ago when they, some of them treated it like a warm up. Some of them really wanted to win it and they wound up with silver and they were really unsatisfied. They came back, Virtue and Moyer came out of retirement, Chan came out of retirement, and they really went for it this time. It paid off. Will it pay off in their individual performances? Caitlin Osmond, who said that, you know, it kind of takes the pressure off now. We have an Olympic medal, and it's not just an Olympic medal, it's the Olympic medal in our back pockets. So we go in with maybe more confidence, with less pressure, but, the pairs team of Megan Duhamel and Eric Radford said, no, 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 no. Just as much pressure, we're going to put it on ourselves because we still want to have two great individual performances. We still want another gold medal. What better way to go out? Uh, Virtue and Moyer, you, you got to expect they're in the running for that gold medal in, in ice dance. Patrick Chan's in a slightly different spot. He wasn't considered a real contender here for a medal until he laid down that long program. In the team event, he landed two quads. He stumbled through a couple of triple axles, but finessed his way through the back end of the program and wound up winning the darn thing. Granted, there was only five skaters in there and some of the best opponents were not in that competition. So that's a factor, but he's got the confidence now. He's also been on that ice twice in real competition. Some of his opponents have not. Some of them haven't skated a single program yet. So that's got to play to Chan's advantage. So I think overall, the Canadian team is obviously thrilled with the team event medal and probably really confident heading into their own individual events, which should probably produce two or three more medals.